Offensively, the Pistons dominate in the paint, but it's stopping their opponents from scoring there and beyond the three-point line that indicates a significant defensive improvement is possible. For more on that, here's NBA.com's John Schumann. Last season, the Detroit Pistons allowed their opponents to attempt just 56% of their shots from the restricted area or three-point range, the lowest rate in the league. The restricted area and three-point range are the areas of the floor that yield the most points per attempt. So if you can limit your opponent's layups and threes, you have the foundation of a good defense. And no team did a better job of forcing their opponents to shoot from the area in between than the Pistons did. But Detroit ranked just 13th in defensive efficiency last season, as its opponents shot above the league average at the rim from three-point range and in between. Andre Drummond ranks as a below average rim protector and Tobias Harris doesn't provide much support as a small ball four. The Pistons defense got scorched in getting swept by the Cleveland Cavaliers in the first round of the playoffs. But according to Sportview, the Pistons ranked high in regard to ball pressure and only one team contested a greater percentage of its opponents jump shots. The Pistons had a top 10 defense against the league's 10 best offensive teams. The Pistons didn't make any major changes to their rotation this summer. Defensive improvement will have to come from within. But the foundation, a scheme that forces the right kinds of shots, is already in place.